Capricorn, welcome back. We are going to do Aries, you Pisces first. See what your person, specific zodiac sign could be thinking, feeling. Keep in mind, rules can be reversed if it is not your story. Acknowledge and move on. Okay, and then we will do a mini spread. Aries, what's the Aries thinking, feeling right now? All right, so either way, they're up in their head. They're very upset about something. Seems like there was a beginning that didn't turn out exactly the way they wanted it to be. Why the Nine of Swords? Why are they all up in their head? Okay, because there was an ending in their situation. So now this can be somebody that you had broken up with or it can be something from their past and now they're moving forward. So it looks like they need to let go of some things first. Okay, when we get to Libra, I will switch decks. So that's what we have for Aries, Taurus. What do you have for Taurus? All right, the Taurus. Okay, they want to, you know, they want to connect with you. They're offering something small here. I'd say that the Taurus has some intention. Can be at a distance from you, but this is communication moving forward and trying to get to know you. It can be starting small, like a friend trying to fill you out a little bit. What do we have at the bottom of the deck? Yep. I mean, I'm going to put this one back in. So that's the Page of Cups. This person does, you have two pages. So nice beginnings, not too fast. Could be somebody that you friend zoned and they're trying to feel you out. I'm going to tell you that much right now. Okay, moving on to Gemini. What's the Gemini thinking, feeling? Ooh. All right, so there we're starting at, ooh. Somebody wants to collaborate with you. This is person here, this Gemini, wants to kind of, ooh, 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 bottom of the deck. They want to three of cups you. They want to make a, you have two threes, collaboration. Okay, Wheel of Fortune. So things are moving positively forward, working together with somebody for a connection. Something to celebrate. Can be that simple. Can be celebrations of somebody that you know at work as well. I'm just going to stick that in there too. Okay. Moving on to Cancer. Cancers. All right. So the Cancer right now is trying to balance passion, emotions. Mm -hmm. I mean, they do want to offer something. A lot of pages for you here already there. Mm -mm -mm, cappies. Something new coming your direction. The Page of Wands is... They're very excited. They're very anxious. They want to get rolling. They've got a lot of ideas. It's something moving forward. Surprise messages. I think this looks pretty damn good. The king kind of sits back. He's outgoing. He gets what he wants. He's determined. Mm -hmm. Let's see what we have for Leo. All right. The Leo... Definitely a Leo. Can be holding back in a situation and they are not moving forward at any time. There is no communication with this person. Mm -mm. All right. Virgo, and then we will switch steps. Virgo. What do we have for Virgo? All right. Okay, so the Virgo is, they can be, yeah, I would be careful with this one. They can be emotionally codependent. Could have been a breakup with somebody. Bottom of the deck, we have the two cups. So they could want to reunite. Now, they also could have just gotten over this heartache. However, they're still codependent and want a union. So I don't know that this person is necessarily ready for a connection. How do you feel? Oh, well, I don't know. You might be interested, though. Okay. So we're going to move this out of the way and move on to Libra. Okay. Grabbing a new deck. Okay, what do we have for Libra? All right. The Libra ain't talking. Mm -mm. They're holding back. They're being kind of shitty and selfish with their everything. <laughs> now, they could just be where they feel inept, feel not good enough. But it can be a self Pisces that you're dealing with. But they don't, they're not coming forward your direction. They can be a little bit shilly, shitty chilly acting jealous the moon is not sharing all the emotions or something that's not quite known about the libra right now all right let's move on scorpio okay so the scorpio 
wants to be judged fairly could have an apology for you but it's somebody that you know has given there's an emotional reflection can be a Taurus as well that you're dealing with they want a connection with you yeah I'm not going to get too into detail because I am doing a mini spread for you too. Just trying to give you a little bit of an idea here. Okay, Sagittarius. All right. Sagittarius. Slow as hell. Okay, so it can be somebody that's at a distance from you. They don't know what the hell is being offered to them. They're very much up in their head. Okay, so it can be trying to determine what direction they want to go. This is going to take a little, a lot of time, actually. I'm going to tell the truth here. Nine of Pentacles, slowest guy in the deck. Three of Wands, waiting. Mm -mm -mm. So you're going to be waiting for this person to try to get past their past before they are ready to go anywhere. Okay, Capricorn. Okay, Capricorn also can have a Virgo placement. I like to throw those at you so you have an idea. They're feeling very burdened right now. They're not ready to move. I mean, they're starting to plan to move forward. Hermit, they're reflecting. They're alone. They're trying to isolate themselves because of a burden. They still have a little left in them. It's just like <sighs> trying to drop some of the doubt, trying to drop some of the burden. It can be a little bit on the sensitive side. It can be, you know, that <sighs> sticking up for themselves because of crap that they had been through in the past. So it's going to be a little bit of wait for that person to... Alrighty, Aquarius. Aquarius. Alright, they're dropping a situation. They, they're not trying to even work on this. No. Three of Cups reverse? Really? This looks like a breakup. No, it can be just their breakup that they had had. But this person is just dropping it. They're, they're not, they're so restless, it's insane. Hmm. Can also be that there's, this person doesn't have trust issues because of a third party situation that they had been through or feel that you put them in one. Okay. All right. Screw the Aquarius. On to Pisces. Okay, it can also be a Gemini, but we have the Lovers here, and we have the Five of Swords, and we have the Nine of Cups, so it looks like something needs to be talked out. This person's going to be kind of <sighs> talking above you, not above you, talking over your voice. They want to be heard. They want wish fulfillment. They want to move forward. It is definitely somebody that there is some emotion here with. Bottom of the deck, we got the Queen of Cups. So emotionally available, wanting a connection. Very intense energy and very intense connection. Okay. So now we are going to move on to a mini spread for you and try to narrow it down a little bit for you and your person. Okay. What do we have? Source Spirits Guides. What do we have? Overall energy. Okay, so you've got three pentacles reversed and the nine of swords. So there's something that needs to... You're feeling very alone right now and you're letting go of burdens from shit that you have been through. But you are letting go of it. So you've decided to be alone at this time is what it feels like to me. How are you feeling? Let's see what your energy is. Keep in mind, roles can be reversed. What is your energy? Okay, so you want things that are traditional... Can be a Taurus that you're dealing with. Ooh, you got two major arcana. You're holding back. You're holding back your emotion. Definitely. You got the ace of pentacles. You're not ready right now. Whatever had happened up here, I have to stick it out there. Can be a third party. Had led you to that. So you're trying to get over some emotions. But you have somebody that's got some emotion that wants to come your direction or just is very emotionally available. Holy crap. Yeah. They want to connect with you. Can be a Leo, can be a Taurus, can be a water sign that you're dealing with. This feels kind of new, I've got to tell you. You're not ready for this. You're like putting the brakes on this crap. 
You're holding back. I mean, there can be passion here, but you want things that are very stable, very traditional, or screw it. Let's see what we have moving forward. Oh, oh boy. All right, well, they're not holding back. Can be a cancer as well that you're dealing with. They're willing to put the work into this. They want to win at all costs. Let's make sure you can see this here. All right, that looks better. Okay, move that down. Okay, so Eight of Pentacles is taking a look at all the details, but it's willing to bust their ass in a relationship. You know, put that effort into things. How are you going to feel about this person? Because, boy, they sure have the hots for you and want that. You know, it's not even that they have the hots for you. It's that they want to offer something. Here's you. Now, keep in mind, rules can be reversed. This person might bore you. I mean, are you suspicious of this person? Are you not trusting? Not wanting somebody that's going to be playing emotional games? Or are you going to be playing emotional games with them? Don't do that. It's not nice. Roles can be reversed. But it can be just that you don't trust things right now and you're just not ready. All right. Clarify the strength card. Oi, Hermit. Okay, so it can be a Virgo as well that you are dealing with. However, Hermit and the Two of Wands came up. So you're taking your time before you move. You're reflecting. You're taking an emotional break from everything. You just want to be by yourself and try to get your bearings. Okay? What have we had for advice? This seems like something really new coming your direction. I don't know if you're going to be interested in it or not. Okay. Advice. Okay, well, you're juggling on something. You're juggling on the end of a situation. So you're still holding on to this up here, something that left you feeling really crappy. Somebody that didn't work with you. Okay, but you got the world. Okay, here's your advice. Very good advice. You need to wrap up something from the past. You're, you're sitting between letting it go and not letting it go. You need to make up your mind. If something had ended and it was hurtful and there is no way you can go back that direction, you have something new coming in. It's an emotional person that wants to offer something and they're very intuitive. So they're going to know that you've been hurt, but they're still going to offer you something new, dates, etc. You might be willing to handle that. But you're still, you're, you're holding on. You don't want an end of a situation. Then you juggle, juggle. You don't want this ending. You don't want a new beginning. You need to try to let go of some of that so that you can move forward. Because at the bottom of the deck, we got the page of cups. You've got new potential. Look at this. Queen, ace, page cups. Cups, 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 cups. They want to get involved. And it's showing you, keep in mind, yes, it can be flip-flop, but you're holding back. You want to be sure of what you're going to be planning in the future and what direction you're going. You've got paths to choose. You're really thinking about it. Still a bit anxious about it. Anything else? Anything else that they need to know, Source? Anything else? I don't think so. I think that is the energy that we have for you today. Yeah, four, okay. Four of Swords on the bottom of the deck. Nothing else popped out for me, so I'm going to leave it there. Four of Swords is taking that, that time out to, you know, it's, try not to be so emotionally cold. Try to feel for yourself. You're distancing yourself, and that's, that's healthy. That's cool. You're trying to clear your head. Clear your head from the separation that you've had so that you can have... A new beginning. All right, this is the energy that I have for you today. Please do give a thumbs up to help circulate the videos. Thank you for watching and many blessings.